Put your glasses up, put your glasses up, a toast to the men. Welcome to a toast to the men with your guy SD Booker. Once again, we got Wednesdays with Yaya, my beautiful, intelligent, sweet wife, Yaya. Oh. How you doing? I'm good. How are you? I've been good. I've been good. I had a productive week so far and a productive day. I can tell. Yeah, got a lot taken care of. I so let's get started. Now, today's topic. Is it okay to go through your spouse's phone without their permission? Hmm. What's your take on that? Hmm. My take would be no. Okay. What reason would I have to pry in your personal information? I put that on the same line as a man going through a woman's purse. Mm. Like, I have no. no reason to go through your phone unless unless there's an emergency. Yeah, yeah, that's my take on it. Um, uh, I think I've, I've never gone through your purse without permission, but even with permission i mean it has to be something where i'm in a rush right <laughs> and you might be in the bathroom uh, in the tub and i'm in a rush and you got something in there right. i really need the only uh, thing I, I think i've seen you go as far as <clears throat> excuse uh, me maybe unzipping it that's it <laughs> yeah I'll, I'll bring it to you yeah 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 i'm not i've never been into that um i've never gone through anyone's purse with, without their permission but uh, even with their permission I really don't do it. Right. Yeah, that's just, that ain't my thing. Um, but I, there's two sides to that, though. Okay. If someone makes it a big deal to not go through their phone or purse, that might be a red flag, too. Mm -hmm. You yeah. know what I'm saying? You get the feeling they're hiding something. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Have you ever gone through my phone? No. And you know what? I know that I've grown a lot because you've fallen asleep. Mm -hmm. Many times with your phone open. Mm -hmm. And I just look at it, turn it over so that the light is not showing. But I've had many opportunities to do that. You don't want to mess up a good thing, huh? Oh, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, I'm what's, just saying. I'm messing purpose? with you. <laughs> I'm messing with you. But I, I, I ain't got no. I mean, you got my passcode anyway. Right. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so, yeah, it's no it's no big deal. Uh yeah, so yeah, we just, you know, it's, that's just not an issue with us. But, you know, I gave you my passcode. You didn't ask for it. I gave it to you just mm -hmm. because the way I think. Right. You know, the way I think is, man, I got a lot of information in my phone. And, man, if something happens, if I collapse. Right. If, uh, if I can't get to it or I get separated from it, but I need something in it. Mm -hmm. If I die, then I got passcodes uh, to money markets uh, accounts mm -hmm. and... Uh, you know, just, just just all kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And uh you know, you need you need that. You need access to that. Right. So uh that's why I do it. I'm always thinking like that. Yeah. I think there's one maybe one time you had to go through my phone and that was to get a doctor's phone number, I think. There was an emergency that took place late right. at night. Right, right, right. Yeah, that was years ago. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the that's the only time. Um but yeah, yeah, I mean, like I said, it's two sides to it. If someone is going through your phone, if your spouse is going through your phone without your permission, that's a problem. If right. you make it a big deal about them not going through your phone, I mean, that may be a problem. That may be a red flag. Right. So. Oh, it's going to raise a red flag. Yeah, I, yeah. Yeah, you, you, I will just be waiting on an opportunity to see that phone open again and just run with it. But. Well, why? I'm just saying, if there was a red flag, yeah, but there's not, so yeah, so yeah. I mean, this is this is a short video. We we uh, I saw this question posed on another video. I said, well, let's let's touch on it. You know, see what the people say in the comments. We'll see. It's not really something we can really re relate to, though. Mm -hmm. Um, I can't, you know, unless they didn't mention it. I can't think of anyone I was with that went through my phone. You know, to my knowledge. Mm -hmm. uh, anyone go, going through your purse? Or no. your phone? Um, no, not that I remember. 
Yeah. Oh, actually, you know what? Yeah, years ago. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, probably about 20 years ago. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if it's if it gets to that point, yeah, I, I, I got to give you to the streets, though. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, you know, it, if, it, if it gets to that where, because uh, at that point, my psyche is messed up. I didn't lost my edge. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, yeah. Because you got to be able to relax around the person. Yeah, I um, mean, yeah. It's just peace of mind. It's right. part of peace of mind. So, yeah. if you go searching for something, yeah, yeah. You're, you're not looking <clears throat> right. for peace of mind yeah. at all. Yeah, I mean, I think that's the end of the game at that point. Mm -hmm. Once you start going through the phone, the phone. I mean, I think that's the end. Right. So, yeah, we just can't really relate, but I thought we'd bring it up. Yeah. We don't, I don't really, we don't talk about these topics in detail at all. Probably not even on the surface. We just, I just give the title right. uh, before we record because I want it to be uh, authentic and organic. And so I didn't know what she was going to say. You didn't know what I was going to say. Right. Yeah. That's but, true. But we, well, it's a short video, but I, I bet you the percentage of uh, couples that have this issue is pretty high. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I've heard some stories. Yeah. But, yeah, we just can't relate to it, really. Yeah. So, hey, this is a short one. We'll see you next Wednesday. I'll, I'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> but uh, we'll both see you guys next Wednesday. As always, from us to you, love. Peace. Peace.